What's up y'all? So today's video has been highly requested. I get questions all the time in my DMs asking about my experience with laser hair removal. Um, so I just wanted to talk about it a little bit, share some info because I was always so curious about it and had so many questions about it. And so for those of you who may be wanting to get it or just get some more info about it, I'm your girl and I'm gonna answer all the questions. Um, I asked you guys over on my Instagram what questions you wanted to know. So make sure to follow me on Instagram if you wanna be a part of future like questions boxes because um, Taylor and I are always asking questions on our Instagram for our YouTube videos. Okay so one of the top questions was where all did you get it done? I got it all over my legs under my armpits and then I got my bikini line so I didn't get everywhere down there just got the bikini line so that's where I got it all done just for an FYI when I'm answering these questions. Okay so a lot of people ask do you let the hair grow out long before you can get the treatment done? So actually no you actually have to shave like the morning of your appointment like same day. I mean I don't know if you technically have to do it same day maybe before but you're supposed to go clean like no hair completely shaved for it to work the best someone asked was it awkward so I feel like the only way it could be a little awkward is if you got it done all over down there um, but I didn't I just got my bikini line so if you get your bikini line you should be able to wear like a swimsuit bottom or keep your underwear on or something that's what I did and funny story the person who actually did my laser was Taylor's mom um, where he works they offer things like that and so she was the one who actually did it for me but yeah I don't think it's definitely not awkward to get like your legs or anything else done But I guess if you were getting that area done, I guess it could be a little bit same like if you were to go get a wax or something But bikini line you should be able to just keep like your swimsuit on or something. That's what I do Um, lots of people asked any side effects. I had zero side effects The only thing I think I had was I think maybe one or two times after getting my armpits done I had a little bit of soreness like right here for like an hour after that's it But it wasn't pain at all like honestly didn't even really feel it But if I pressed on it maybe a little bit maybe a little soreness but in other areas no side effects so many people asked is it worth it 100 110%. I know a lot of people have light hair, like if you're born with blonde hair, you know, hair growth isn't that much of a problem for those kinds of people because, you know, it could even be growing and no one would even be able to tell. But in my case, my hair was very dark, especially under my armpits. So I used to say I was only, I really only wanted to get it done under my armpits because no matter how much I shave, I felt like you could just still see it, you know, you could see darkness like under the skin, things like that. And so if you have like darker hair, totally recommend it. Um, I recommend it to anyone, honestly, just so you don't have to shave. But especially if you have like hair, you know, that just shows a lot. It also helps with, so after like my first session or two, my hair was obviously still growing. It was way less, but it was still growing a little bit. But it helped significantly with like the coarseness of the hair and the color. So my hair Hair, after like one or two treatments was like blonde and it was super thin and like soft I don't know if that's the right word but like when I felt it it didn't feel like these like sharp <laughs> little prickles it was just like soft hair you couldn't really see it even though it was growing so just that alone I was like man I'd be okay if it just did this um because you just couldn't tell when it started to grow so kind of following that someone says does it take away dark spots so yeah like I was saying underneath my arms since my hair was like darker I felt like every time I shave you could just still see it just looks dark it just looked like I had a big dark circle now I have none of that like literally none of it it's just smooth like the same way that my Arm looks right here it looks under my arm and that was like a huge insecurity I had even though I wasn't like always lifting my arms I just was so like conscious of doing it like I was like I'm never gonna lift my arms I just because it makes you look like you're not shaving and I was like I mean I would shave I would have to shave like I mean I wouldn't every day obviously but like I could shave twice a day under my arms that's how like fast it grew and like how much I felt like you could see it and so ever since literally no darkness because it takes the hair completely out from underneath the skin like there's just no hair there anymore so totally helps with that totally recommend it for under the arms if you deal with anything like that and if you're just going to get it under the arms it wouldn't be that expensive because there's not that much of space to cover does it make you feel more confident for sure um especially with like bikini line I know a lot of girls deal with just like when you wear swimsuits you can see like razor burn and stuff once you get laser you don't have to shave and you don't have razor burn that has been the biggest like change ever um so that will help under arms help I was never like insecure or anything about like my leg hair I was just knew I had to shave it but yeah as far as this I felt like there was nothing I could do to fix this I felt like my bikini line with like razor burn there was nothing I could do to fix that so in those areas 100% does it actually work it totally 
totally works. Um, I know they'll tell you it's not guaranteed that you'll never have hair grow back, but it'll always lessen your hair growth. Um, whether you have to shave every few weeks rather than every day. So I know it's not guaranteed to fully make you never have to shave again. Like every now and then I'll take a razor and just go like this, just cause I don't know if it's just habit or what. There'll always be times I feel like when you may have to touch up every few weeks or something, but it totally works. Like it's so worth it if it's something that you struggle with or you've been thinking about doing. It is pricey, which we'll talk about in a second, but it really is just so nice. Do you prefer it over waxing and shaving? So I definitely prefer it over shaving. I actually never have been waxed anywhere before, so I don't know how that works, but I will say like waxing, it's painful every time you do it and you're paying for it over and over again. Unless you're doing it yourself, it's probably not as much money, but you have to pay every time you go get a wax, it hurts every time. Laser, you just do it a few times, then it's out of the way and you never have to do it again. You know, there's just so many benefits to it, but so I've never been waxed, so I personally don't really know, but I totally prefer it over shaving because it saves time. It's just so much nicer. You don't have to worry about it growing really. So how long was the process? process um I think it can it can vary a little bit between which place you go to that's why I don't want to give you guys like a definite answer on some of these questions because it'll change depending on where you go so I went in every six to eight weeks and I had a total of six sessions so I don't know how to add that up really really quickly but you know take say you go in every six weeks um so you go in and then you wait another six weeks and you go back in you have to do that six times um but I know it can change like some people have to have a few more sessions some people can have less um so it'll change but it can be that's just the typical it's like every few weeks and then you have like maybe six to eight sessions something like that just to get like an idea of it but I'm sure wherever you decide to go you can go consult and get an idea of what it would be like for you how expensive is it this is another question that varies so much I will say it's not cheap um but like I said, it was worth it for me. If you have that money that you're just considering, is it a good idea? I totally think it is, but it can change. People, sometimes they'll have packages because a lot of people are asking, do you pay per session? Do you pay one price? It's different. Some people have packages you pay all up front. It really just depends. And it also depends how much you're getting done. Obviously, if you're just doing under your arms, it's gonna be way less than if you do both of your full legs because that's like a lot more coverage than just under your arms. Or just like if you were just getting your bikini line, that would probably be the cheapest if I had to guess but also if you have places near you sometimes they'll have sales every now and then so maybe you can like keep an eye out for if they do like a sale sometimes they'll be like get one leg get one leg free type thing so it really just depends but I will say it's just not not the cheapest thing ever but it's worth it and like I said you don't have to get everything done if you just want to get your underarms done you can do that just your bikini line just your legs whatever you want to do someone asked can you shave after an appointment yes you can um at least that's what they told me you can go about shaving, you can do literally anything after, right after your appointment. You can go run, you can go to work, you can literally do anything, nothing stops you. Like I said, there's no like side effects, um, nothing feels different, nothing's different at all. You can kind of just do whatever. So a big question was, did it hurt? And I'm gonna be totally honest with you guys because that was like the main thing I wanted to know before getting it done, because I'm like scared of pain. Um, but I will say, so the more like fat you have on an area, like your thigh, for instance, um, it, you're not gonna feel it at all. Um, my whole entire legs, I felt nothing. Like I didn't even feel, like I felt literally nothing. Um, but I will say like once you get around like your ankles or maybe even like the back of your knee, somewhere that's a little bit more bony, you'll feel it a little bit, but it, I had no pain. So like my whole entire legs, no pain. If I felt anything, it'd be around like my ankle or maybe even on top of my shin or something where you can feel the bone a little, more, a little bit more or behind my knee, still no pain at all i will say under my arms so this is so weird i don't think anyone like a lot of people experience this but every time she did my right arm you can definitely feel this i wouldn't say the pain is bad like i wasn't sitting there like for my armpits but you can definitely feel it um every time she did my right couldn't like no no pain then on my left i was a little bit more i could feel it a little bit more under my left arm i don't know why that was just me i don't think that's like common thing um but under arms still not much pain but you can definitely feel it because think about it, there's no like fat right there. Um, and then bikini line, I will say it's 
you can feel a little bit of pain. It's not unbearable. Like every time I would go back in for another appointment, I wasn't like, oh my gosh, I'm scared. Like it hurts. Not at all, but it's definitely just one of those areas. I mean, think about it. You know, waxing's gonna hurt a little bit. Even shaving sometimes can hurt a little bit. So it's just, I would say a little bit more uncomfortable than like obviously your legs, for instance. Um, but keep in mind, I only did my bikini line. I didn't do anywhere else down there. So don't take my word for it on anywhere else. I will just say though, it's totally worth it. Like it's not one of those pains that's like, I wouldn't contemplate getting it. I feel like just because of the feeling, cause it's just kind of a little bit more of an uncomfortable feeling. It's not bad. Someone asked how long does one session last? It just depends kind of what you get done. Um, under my arms takes less than 10 minutes, like for both. Like this probably takes three minutes, three minutes. Bikini line, I would say 10 minutes at most. Legs about 30 minutes. It could even take up to 45, really just depends. Um, but yeah, I'm out of there within an hour, so it's not long. Okay, one last question. Do you ever have to shave? Um, so I kind of answered this earlier, but no, not really. Um, I feel like, like I said, I'll just kind of like brush the razor over, but I never notice like that I super have to shave. So it has worked great. I know I've heard a lot of people asked, um, are you worried about it growing back with pregnancy one day? Um, I haven't really looked into that much, but apparently that's a possibility. So I'm not very educated on that. Um, but I will say even, I'm sure if that's the case, you might just have like a little bit of growth. I just think it's so worth it overall. Just even if it lessened my hair growth, it's worth it for me overall, just because of, you know, the darkness, it got rid of that. It got rid of razor burn. Um, I don't, I really don't ever have to shave. So it's just so great. Totally recommend it. Um, but I hope these questions kind of helped you out. I know I'm not like an expert on it. That was just kind of my experience and everything. I was super honest on everything. So I don't want to like lie to you guys and say, you know, you don't feel it on like your bikini area because you definitely will. Like I said, the legs don't feel it at all. Maybe around like those bony areas, but it's so worth it. I'll keep you guys updated like over on my Instagram as time goes on. Like if I notice a little bit of hair growth or anything, um, but over these past few months, I have not noticed anything. So it has been totally awesome. I totally recommend it. If you have any more questions about it, shoot me like a DM on Instagram or you can comment down below and I'll try to like get back to you on that. But I covered most of the questions that I got on Instagram. So I hope this helps. And if you go end up getting your laser, message me and let me know how it goes. Love y'all.